Hello guys, how are you doing? Are you fine? That's good. Let's talk about our May 19th class, okay? On this text, we will learn a little more about the premiere of The Lost World, Jurassic Park. Have you seen this movie? I love it. It's one of my, my favorite movies of all time. I love Jurassic Park. So, the text mentions the day of its premiere and talks a little about the story of the movie. It comes, it comes after, four years after the original movie and it shows dinosaurs roaming free, living in their own lives, in their own ecosystem, in a different island than the first movie. And it talks about a group that is planning to capture them and take them to the mainland to use them as attractions in a park. All right? Some verbs that we have on the text. We have the verbs to direct, to write, to base on, to produce, to return, to include, to set, to center, to roam, and to take. Okay? After that, we're going to talk about home practice. The home practice exercise is going to start on page 1272. On the first exercise for juniors, seniors and masters, you guys had to complete the sentences using will or would. So, letter A, number one. She promised she will be there with me at Jurassic World or she promised that she would be there with me at Jurassic World. Number two, my friends didn't expect that she would be there anyway. Number three, I would like a ticket, please. Number four, if you had to make a choice, what would you decide to watch? Number five, five, what do you think would happen in the Jurassic Park movie? Six, if I have time, I will watch this movie. Seven, I'm really not sure whether she will be free next week. Eight, I hope she will be able to do what she wants. Okay? Letter B, you had to complete the sentences using was going to or were going to. The two, ver the two forms of to be going to in the past. So, number one. Is Amanda going to stay after class? He was going to stay, but he found out he had a meeting to go later. Number two, are our neighbors going to sell their apartment? Jeff and Julianne were going to sell until the real estate market crashed. Okay. Three, was Elena going to buy a new car? Well, she was going to buy a new car until she lost her job. Number four, what are Jeff and Julianne doing tomorrow night? They were going to watch a movie, but instead they made reservations at a restaurant. And number five, did the plumber come to fix the toilet today? He was going to come this morning, but his truck broke down. Six, did Sarah pay the credit card bill last week? I can't remember. No, she didn't. She said she was going to, until she got paid. Number seven, is Tony coming to our party? He was going to come, but he couldn't find a babysitter for his kids. Number eight, are you cooking lunch? I was going to cook until the power went out. After that, seniors and masters had a different exercise. Okay, you had to write sentences using was going to or were going to. For example, for the senior, I was going to become a novelist, but I decided it would be better if I were a teacher. And the masters, I was going to team up with my friend to develop a new RPG, but a book grabbed my attention and I couldn't keep working on it. Okay? So let's go to our review, guys. What are the topics for this class? We're going to talk about will, would, and to be going to in the past. Let's start talking about the two modal verbs, will and would. What is the idea of will? Will will talk about the prediction for the future. Would will talk about two different ideas. Would can be a hypothesis 
or it can be the past of will. When you made a prediction, when you made a plan with will in the past. Okay? So, our structures for will and would, they are the same because they are both modal verbs. So, for the affirmative form, we're going to have the subject, the modal verb, the main verb in base form, and a complement. For negative sentences, the subject, the modal verb, not, the main verb in the base form, and, of course, a complement. And, for the interrogative form, we will start with the modal verb, subject, main verb, and base form, and our complement. For example, we can say using will, Taika Waititi will direct toward Love and Thunder. Using would, Disney would produce a new Chronicles of Narnia movie, but they postponed it. So, and for was and were going to, verb to be in the past, going to. What is the idea? We're gonna mention um, plans that we made in the past, but didn't work out. They were not successful. Okay? I made a plan, but I didn't do it. This is when I use was and were going to. The structures. For the affirmative form, I'm gonna have subject, was or were, going to, the verb in the base form, and a complement. Negative form. Subject, was or were, plus not, going to, verb, and complement. Interrogative form, was or were, subject, going to, verb and base form, and of course, the complement. Okay? For example, Rick Riordan was going to write Percy Jackson, but Fox didn't let him do it. You see? He had the plan, but it didn't work out. Okay? So, guys, if you still have any problems, any, any doubts about will, would, and to be going to in the past, talk to your teachers, okay? Now, watch your life class, do your class practice exercises after that, and don't forget, like our video, leave your comments here, and of course, subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any other verbs. Okay, guys, thank you very much for your attention. See you next class. Bye-bye.